All right, so after that very interesting conversation, let's summon the war table. Um, sorry, gather the war table and summon the Inquisition again. How fares your quest to seal the breach? I'm doing everything within my power. A task such as closing the bridge is a heavy burden. I hope you do not carry it alone. We remember Andraste, but Andraste did not carry the Chant of Light alone. She had generals, advisors, even her husband for a time. Do everything within your power, but remember those who would help you. I appreciate, I appreciate the word of wisdom. Your insight, Mother Giselle. Take it for whatever it is worth. You walk a difficult path, and there is little enough I can do to aid you. In any case, I pray this Inquisition proves less brutal than its predecessor. Let's hope so too. We don't want a bloodshed here. Do you know who the Grand Clerics will choose as the next Divine? It is a difficult decision. All the obvious candidates perished with Divine Justinia at the Conclave. The Grand Clerics are terrified of the Inquisition. They will not decide soon, and I fear they will not decide wisely. Whoever is chosen needs the Inquisition's support. No one else seems likely to seal the breach. Well, I don't think they have the power to seal the breach or the rifts. How are the people doing after what happened at the Conclave? They are scared, of course. Many have lost homes or loved ones. I doubt many will sleep well until you have sealed the breach. I have offered what help I can. The rest is for the Inquisition. What more do you wish to know? Farewell. Until next time. That was probably a better status report than the uh, requisitions officer, so let's uh, do another quick save and uh, summon the war council, I guess. Feature uh, operations. So it looks like we can actually deploy our forces uh, via have different routes. We have secrets, connections, inquisition, forces. Presumably, each task or each type of um, Inquisition task can be assigned to a certain character that's part of the War Council. Um, so right here we're using forces, we can tell Commander Cullen what to do, what to accomplish or establish for us um, on behalf of the Inquisition. I do want to know the underworld knowledge because uh, In this type of scenario, information is power. And we need to gather as much allies as we can, as many allies as we can. Whether it be underworld forces or not, um, I, I need to know everything. I need to know what exactly we're up against politically as well. But since we only have one Inquisition power, we're going to go with the forces for now. And the war cancel is further broken down via the map of Orlay or the map of Ferelden. So let's see what we want to do. Um, Orlay is presumably similar to France. Ferelden, I feel, is similar to England, personally. I don't know if there's any historical accuracy or references, but that's just how I feel in terms of the accents and the way people sort of portray themselves within these countries um, in the past. Having the origins. Herald address the clerics is not a terrible idea. You can't be serious. Mother Giselle isn't wrong. 
At the moment, the Chantry's only strength is that they are united in opinion. And we should ignore the danger to the Herald. Let's ask him. I think she might be right on this one. We need all the help we can get. Um, especially Chantry support. What can they do? It's just talk. Don't underestimate the power of their words. An angry mob will do you in just as quickly as a blade. I will go with him. Mother Giselle said she could provide us names. Use them. But why? This is nothing but a... What choice do we have, Liliana? Right now we can't approach anyone for help with the breach. Use what influence we have to call the clerics together. Once they are ready, we will see this through. Alright, so before we had the Inquisition power, now we actually have power costs which are accumulated over a period of time, similar to experience points. Um, and we can use these power costs to in pretty much embark on a new type of quest that will further the influence of the Inquisition. Speak only the word. Trophy has been unlocked and look at Cullen. He's a sexy beast. Actually, never mind. The, the, the trivia card doesn't make him look very good, but we do appreciate the backstories. And uh, if I was playing on this on my own and not Let's Play, I'd be reading it. So That's just the downright truth. This is a strangely very, very long loading screen. Probably could have finished a bag of chips by now. Eh? <laughs> My gloves look kind of funny. It doesn't quite fit the, uh, the wanderer adventurer moves. outfit that we have right now. Fear me, guess, mortal. Seeker, but I think they all know who we are. Your skills of observation never fail to impress me, Beric. My Lord Herald. You're one of Leliana's people. What have you found? The Chantry Mothers await you, but so do a great many Templars. There are Templars here? People seem to think the Templars will protect them from... from the Inquisition. They're gathering on the other side of the market. I think that's where the Templars intend to meet you. Only one thing to do, then. If it's a fight they want, we'll just have to flex our biceps and show them what they got. Uh, sorry, show them what we got. <laughs> show them what they got. Uh, well, they got uh, heavy-ass armor. <laughs> heavy-ass Templar armor. And anti-magic, which wish is to not good for the me. People? From us? Return to Haven. Someone will need to inform them if we are delayed. As you say, my lady. Ooh, what's this? We have plaques stuck on the wall here. Well, actually, more like a ledge, not a wall. Well, whatever gives us XP, man. Whatever gives us XP. We're so close to level 5, guys. We are very, very close. I can almost taste it. Yes. Yes. We did it. Level 5. Yes. Alright, well, it's free XP, so I'm not going to turn that away. Despite the fact I'm not going to read it, but... I got a skill, sp I got a skill point to spend. Um... Do I really want that? Actually, no, I already have that. What am I thinking? Spiritual spells to the rescue. Uh, there's nothing too enticing about these, actually. Hmm. 
I, I guess I can use barrier. I mean, <sighs> yeah, it's um, our character is always a, a little bit ahead of everybody else. So when you see soy sauce stand leveling up, everybody else is just stays the same or um, pretty much takes a while to to get there. But actually, mind blast is not a bad idea. Mind Blast can be very helpful. I think. Mind Blast is very good at uh, Origins. Despite not, not it working very well. Uh, sorry, despite it not working very well um, against certain certain type of creatures, but against uh, human opponents, human hostiles, it's the bomb, man. It's the bomb. Oh, that's this is a lovely looking place. Does that remind you of France, ladies and gentlemen? Probably not with the tall, weird hats. Huh, what's this? It's a map. Why do we need a map? The threat remains. Okay. We already have our own map. We don't need this. It's excessive. Ooh. La Pong. See, that's French. You know? For the viewers who are fluent in French, I do that. I do believe that means apple. All right, I, I did not cheat. I did take a little bit of French uh, during my high school years, but uh, I'm far from being fluent. I, I would say I'm not fluent at all. I understand a little bit, a teeny weeny little bit. Good people of Val Royo, hear me. Together, we mourn our divine. A naive and beautiful heart silenced by treachery. You wonder what will become of a murderer. Well, wonder no more. Behold. The so-called Herald of Andraste, claiming to rise where our beloved fell. We say this is a false prophet. The Maker would say no mage in our hour of need. Woman, that's just a discriminatory type of propaganda. That's... what? You Her say I so am the enemy. The breach in the sky is our true enemy. We must unite to stop it. It's true. The Inquisition seeks only to end this madness before it is too late. It is already too late. The Templars have returned to the Chantry. They will face this Inquisition and the people will be safe once more. Oh my god, you just hit a woman. How could you? What the heck was that? Still yourself. Oh my is god, he looks... He looks so disturbingly evil, too. That grin. That menacing grin. Was that display supposed to impress me? On the contrary, it wasn't for you at all. Lord Seeker Lucius, it's imperative that we speak with... You will not address me. Lord Seeker? Creating a heretical movement. Raising up a puppet as Andraste's prophet. You should be ashamed. You should all be ashamed. The Templars failed no one when they left the Chantry to purge the mages. You are the ones who have failed. You who'd leash our righteous swords with doubt and fear. If you came to appeal to the Chantry, you are too late. The only destiny here that demands respect is mine. I think we're gonna have a problem, Seeker Lu Lucius. We're gonna have a very big problem. What we truly need is an alliance that will seal the breach. Oh, the breach is indeed a threat. 
But you certainly have no power to do anything about it. But Lord Seeker, what if he really was sent by the Maker? What if... You are called to a higher purpose. Do not question. I will make the Templar Order a power that stands alone against the Void. We deserve recognition. Independence. You have shown me nothing, and the Inquisition less than nothing. Templars, Val Royo is unworthy of our protection. We march. Wait, what? They're gonna leave Val Royal? Charming fellow. Sorry, Val Royal. Has Lord I can't pronounce it. <laughs> They're just gonna walk away. After punching a woman. Do you know him what very well? The heck? He took over the Seekers of Truth two years ago, after Lord Seeker Lambert's death. He was always a decent man, never given to ambition and grandstanding. This is very bizarre. Well, Cassandra, it's clear that he doesn't like us very much, Fortunately, and the uh, we can't really form much of an alliance with I the wouldn't Templars write them off at so him, at, there must uh, be those in the with order Lucius see what at the helm. Become. That is By not going to be achievable. We should first return to Haven and inform the others. All right, so let's do some damage control. This um, victory must please you greatly, Sika Cassandra. We came here seeking only to speak with the mothers. This is not our doing, but yours. And you had no part in forcing our hand? Do not delude yourself. Now we have been shown up by our own Templars, in front of everyone. And my fellow clerics have scattered to the wind along with their convictions. Just tell me one thing. Are you the Maker's Chosen, as so many claim? I don't really believe in destiny, so I can't really answer the that truth, question I don't personally. That is more comforting than you might imagine. I suppose it is out of our hands now. We shall all see what the Maker plans in the days to come. Well, we all can't just depend on the Maker. If you want to get things done, you gotta take it to your own hands. So what happens now? Will the Chantry continue to denounce me? <laughs> We have already done so. And what good has it done us? Now it falls on us to select a new divine, if we can. And leave the next step to her. Provided such a selection is even possible. I truly don't know. Any revered mother who could have followed Justinia died at the Conclave. What becomes of us, and your Inquisition, is in the Maker's hands now. Well, that doesn't tell me anything. Um, can you please tell me something I don't Lord already Seeker know? Taking the Templars? I can't begin to guess the Lord Seeker's mind. He could not have abandoned his intended role more completely. There must be sense to what we can't see. Must there? Rebellion seems popular in certain quarters, doesn't it, Seeker? He's crafting the Templars into a new power. Really any worse than declaring a rival to the Chantry itself? I really don't know. I really don't know. How many Templars turned on the Chantry exactly? They rebelled across Thedas. Some remained loyal, but not enough to call them the Order. The White Spire here in the capital was the largest garrison, but now... It stands empty. Perhaps more shall flock to the Lord Seeker's banner now. How far has faith waned, I wonder? I'm not sure who would actually follow Lord it's not Seeker. Too late. Or in the Gentry could still help us and come out on top. Assault. If only that were true. Defenseless What's to old lady from trying? We are not looking for a winning horse. Not quite the gentleman we are type, right? <laughs> trying to do the right thing. It's a great question, Mother. What is the right thing to do? Only the Maker knows, as she has said over and over open? again. Open? Yes, as open as I can be. Uh, if you've a need for the well cut or the sparkling, perhaps I can help. At the very least, we can appear. 
Like everything is normal, yes. This guy's completely delusional. Uh, let's not listen to him. <laughs> What's that? An arrow with a message? As I can be. Uh, if you've a need for the well cut or the sparkling, perhaps I can help. At the very least, we can appear like everything is normal. Sorry guys, I knew I said that I wouldn't really read too much notes, too many of these uh, documents, but that one is actually a little bit more out of the ordinary. It is a little bit more interesting compared to the ones that we've gotten before about saving the farmer's cattle, saving the that met orphan's mother, the yada yada yada. Day, that kind of stuff. I have an invitation for you. We get an invitation from the first enchanter, Vivian. Which means that uh, the circle of mages wants to reach out to us. Being a mage myself, I can't... Obviously can't really turn this down, but... The timing of this invitation is quite suspicious. If you think about it. 